Hello everyone. Look, this is one Seagate pension drive. And we can see this is the error message uh, for the Seagate Rosewood A5 family. Now we can check. And this error message looks like very similar, um, like the head damage errors. We can see this one. Anyway, besides these error messages, we can also find out other messages together with this fail servo operation. And we can see this one. And we have tried to uh, back up the ROM and write us on like a ROM. After power off, we get this one in the COM terminal. Then we try to send this unlock key to unlock the firmware arrow. After that, we can see we entered the F3T prompt. But we still get some error, such as the starting LBA read write request arrow. And let's continue. We can see there are more errors. So that means this kind of error, they are not successive and they are coming together with some other errors. So at this time, we need to try more on the firmware repair to fix these kind of error messages. If only these error messages and cannot enter the F3T prompt, then we need to open the hard drive and diagnose the heads and surfaces. But if these error messages come together with other error messages, then we can try to repair the firmware corruption. Now, finally, we still get some of the LED error. If the LED comes out of the uh, COM terminal, that means the drive gets dark. Then we cannot do anything within the COM terminal. Anyway, now we have come to this. This is the pension drive we just work on for the client. And we can see the drive has been totally repaired and then we come to the DFL DDP data recovery software and this is a NOSTA partition detected and here are all the documents so users just need to Select the wanted files and right click to save the folders and files. So this client is very lucky to get this pension drive recovered. Thank you for watching the video.